Hi everyone, my name is Ying Zheng and today I will introduce you a financial software which name is JSTOCK. Firstly, you need to go to SOC4G.net and download that. That should be on Business and Enterprise. So the first one you can see here, is the project of the month is JSTOCK. And JSTOCK is a free stock market software which has 26 different countries language so which means if your first language is not English you can actually choose your own language to display and you can go ahead and click download download that software to your computers it is safe yeah because I already do the wire scan for it so don't worry about the safety issues. And after you download, you can open that one. It usually takes, I mean, it takes first one or two seconds to open it. But since I was recorded, record my screen, so it takes longer. But just like be patient, that be take maybe five seconds. Yeah, just click that one open it in the J stock it is kind of awesome which was like similar as like Yahoo Finance you can use but that was like Yahoo Finance has lots of inform information on the websites so it's hard I mean if you are not familiar with that kind of certain technology but J stock was only for stocks so you can easily track your stocks, I mean, view their current price, view the history price, and track the price so you can be better make your buy or sell decisions. So go ahead and open that JSTOCK. Yeah, it takes, again, for another five seconds, I guess. Be patient. We need to wait until that opens. Again, that usually only take. I mean, you don't have. You will have to wait. But for this one, if you record your screen, it will be take longer. I don't know what's going on, but like it's just like take longer to open that. Okay, here we go. We have that open yes that was open so let me close my documents first so you don't have to pay attention to my some documents with me I mean, here move a little bit here so you can better see that one so what I did is like I track three stocks which is Southwest Google and Apple what you need to do is go ahead and here stocks if you know their symbols you can easily I mean enter the symbols which is the fast way but if you don't know, that doesn't matter. You just need to enter the company's name, which is totally fine. And here is language. Yes, see? Because I'm a Chinese, so that was like have a Chinese option there. Actually, when you download and run that software uh, from your computers, it will automatically uh, comes comes out with your own language as I have a Chinese version of soft Microsoft so that that comes out with Chinese but now I have to select English because I need to introduce you guys this software and a pretty awesome function of this software is like you can see the history data 
all you need to do is go here, click your right button of your mouse. Again, takes it needs their time. I should be able to do that. You click, right click. Click. Hmm. See here, they have like some stuff there. Okay, here we go. That was history. Click history. And take. Oh, this time is fast. It's fast. Yeah, as you see here, what I did is I choose a um, stock price moving average to see like what the what's going on for the stock price history price, so I can make buy or sell decisions. So if you want to see more, click here. Technical analyst in which I choose was stock moving average. I did choose 28 days, 50 days, and 200 days. As you can see here, in as you're moving your mouse, you can see the points here is the stock price and the volume. Uh, what we can see here is like this is like we can compare the stock price with the stock moving average to make buy or sell decisions. And usually, like points here, there'll be a buy decision, and when it's drop, there are sell decisions. So you can easily see. So for better try. If you're a finance major or you're interested in web some stocks, you can download and use this software to make better decisions. Thank you and hopefully hope you will all enjoy this software.